Thank you very much for this opportunity. Uh, my name is Pedro Merola. I am the five generation from farmers in Brazil. And in this Santa Fe, my farm, is I'm the fourth generation in the same land. So it's very proud for me to come here in Australia, 12 hours around the globe, just to talk with you guys and learn all this day and with Rainbow Bank and I really enjoy to be here. So um, when, I, when we say about uh, what we are doing, I think uh, our, when you see a, uh, the, the best profession in the world to think about the value of that, I think it's the, me, me, the people who is a doctor because he saves your life. Uh, you are dying and he can solve you. He can give you more time. After that, I think it's the farmers, because our work, our work well done, can guarantee to the other people in the world they can do other things with their lives and create a new world for us to live. So I really, really proud to be a farmer. Uh, saying that, uh, I was listening to all the people say, saying before me, I think we have to produce uh, in large scale. Uh, uh, bare cheap food with good quality because in the end there's a lot of poor people in the world who have to feed them um, but we're going to talk about feed that's my company in Brazil and feed it's totally different from that feed is the new way of thinking how to make meat in Brazil um, and there, we believe you can do different things and try to, to see different markets. So saying that, uh, we really believe that we can produce food thinking about the pleasure and the taste that you're going to get in your plate. We think you can change the things that we do in our farm to innovate your pleasure that you're going to have in your day-to-day -day experience. And um, we believe that we have a lot, a lot of new customers who really want to pay a little bit more for that. And we really uh, believe too that for us, cooking is an act of love. So the people who sp spend the time cooking for someone, he's doing that because he loved this, this someone. Uh, and you do that at your home. So you can get more pleasure doing that. And for us, the relationship between farmers, retail store, and consumers can be really, really upgraded from what we have now and what we can do. So, what we can do. So, our goal in feed is to start a relationship with our consumers for life. That's what our goal is. That's what all the people who work at feed do every day. They, they, they really want to achieve that. And how we're going to do it? We want to improve their relationship with food in a day-to-day -day home. What, how, can, how can they have more satisfaction doing the same thing that they've already been doing? And uh, we have, in the beginning of the process to do that, feed have a unique product. That's what we developed so much in the last nine years. And we have two and a half years of the retail store. But we start nine years ago producing the food difference. And what we do in the production? We select the breeds that goes very good in Brazil, but change a little bit the type of meat that we're gonna have at our plate. So in Brazil, I don't know if you know, but we use Indian uh, cattle in the beginning of the century, they call Nelori. It's very good, it's very tough, very good for our environment, but it's not as good as Angus or other breeds. So we mix up them, in two or tri three uh, race difference, to try to, to have a good base to produce the meat. After that, we use part of this genetics that is very, very different, and they can assure us that we're gonna repeat the process, have the same quality of product in the end. Uh, I don't know if you guys know that, but there's a new way of producing that it's called grass-fed. Uh, grass fed is when you have the animal until 20 months, 18 months, 25 months of age, 
only eating grass or grass with some corn or something like that. But it's not in a feedlot. In Brazil, everybody produces in a grass before. That's why we have one of the cheapest meats in the world. Uh, we have a lot of land to do it. Uh, but in feed, we produce that, but gain much more weight for the animals and much more good environment. So the tenderness and the, the taste of the, the food will be different. Uh, we, stay in the, the, we put them in the feedlot until they gain 600, 650 kilos. And a very specific way of doing that. And after that, we have the meat done. It's the base product of our uh, company. This part of the business is just the start of our business, just the beginning. Because you have to do that every time perfect to have what we, what we want to do with their life of our customers in their, in their house. And for us, every part of uh, what, uh, groups of animals in a lot of farms is a different experience. And with doing that, we can achieve different kind of food when we are doing it. So uh, we control the whole chain. Well, we know the mother for the cattle who's going to be the, the next three years meat. We know everything about them. We know how to make them produce. And uh, using that, we can have this product. Well, that's not enough. This is just the beginning. Uh, there's a lot of good ideas using that. But you have the customer have to know what you are doing. Have have to understand you and really uh, see valuable in what you are doing. So uh, we develop a shop shopper experience, totally different that I have in São Paulo in our city. We we had a huge store, is a flagship store, where three quarters of this store is just for meat and things that you can use in our cooking process. We are not trying to, to be the supermarket. We are not them. We are, a, we are a meat shop. But we have everything there for the guy who spent with us, not just two minutes, but 30 minutes walking our store. They can uh, learn more, talk about with our employees, and they can, they can tell them how to improve their satisfactions at their home and how to cook it different. And uh, we have there in the back one quarter of the, the, the store a uh, place to produce a uh, very, very different type of experience. And this experience in the noon is to have lunch. We deliver uh, food for 80, 100, 110 people per day. And it's very crowded. And uh, we have there too a lot of courses. Uh, just for kids or for uh, your wife or you who wants to make a barbecue or any type of food that you want to do. We do that in the afternoon. We do, you do that at night. And we do events for our customers when they want to make a birthday different, when they want to improve their relationship with their company, with other companies. We do all that in the back of this, this butcher to uh, make the people feel more liked and have more fun with us. Um, we have different channels for them to get us because this is only the flagship. It's, uh, and we have e-commerce. And this is commerce, you can reach that by an app that's going to be open in, in the December. We are developing an app to help them get from the iPhone without using the internet, normal, normal uh, connections. And we, ha and we have uh, phone calls, because Brazil is regular. People call, I want that, 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 my name is Tal, and we deliver it. We have two hours of delivery time for every customer that we have in our city. So they can order and have the, the, the meat very quickly. And, um, and we help them too with our recipes. We develop uh, 30, uh, 31 recipes until today, different, and to make their day-to-day -day food better than they are having. And in these recipes, you can order the, the meat that's gonna fit to the recipe. So you not have to cut in your house. 
uh, the meat. We already do, do that for you in our way of doing. And with these recipes, we can show them there's a different part of the bulls and the cattle that you can make more pleasure in your in our day-to-day uh, meat. So if you, in Brazil it's regular to use tardilon or uh, steak a poivre with that. In, in, in feed, we change the meats because we, we think about meat a lot. And that's very good because in the last year we discovered seven new cuts from the bull that we didn't have in Brazil. And now they, two of them become success in Brazil and they change the market. A lot of competitors are trying to, to have the same cuts that we have. And uh, in our website, if anyone wants to go there, it's not working. Oh, now it's working. Uh, in our website there, you can have the recipes to do at home. So anyway, everyone is invited, www.feed.com.br. You have a lot of recipes there to, to know how to cook different. And what we're trying to do doing that, what we're trying to create, uh, we are trying to create feed lovers, people who love us for what we are bringing, the value that our company are trying to provide. And with this value, we are trying to expand our market, sell more, uh, have more clients. These clients go to our shop once a month, two, two times a month, but they uh, shop with us every week, so that's very important for us. And they start to put on social media, uh, Instagram, Facebook, every one of them, what they think about us and how they are having pleasure with feed. And that's way, the strategic way that we thought would be more uh, constructive and cheaper to build the, the, the company. And thank God it's helping me a lot. Um, and in these two years, we won two times the best uh, butcher in Sao Paulo, the best meat from the magazines. That's the best magazine in Brazil. Uh, Forbes magazine, uh, they made a list of four butchers, and we are one of them. Who you have to see it. The other one proudly is from... Uh, Australia, it's Victor Churchill, it's perfect. And I really want to go there in this, this holiday that I'm gonna have. And uh, with all that, we had a lot of very, very respectable uh, uh, people from the communication ver uh, ver ver verticals. Uh, this communication, these this people put, a lot, put feed in a lot of magazines in Brazil, and that helped us a lot too. Um, and for do all that, I say uh, that in Bart from the Rainbow Bank all the time is left with me. You have to do it by your heart. You have, you have to do it because you love what you do. And for me, the producing food, be a farmer, and help people eat better is an act of love. You have to do it because you li like it very much. So it's not about the idea, it's about what, what this means to you, you know. So um, for me, uh, feed was a very exciting experience. We are now expanding more. The next year we are opening more channels to sell, to sell our product, to deliver better products to their customers. And it's just two years old, so it's, everything's starting now. So very fun of that. Um, it's a real pleasure to be here. This is my email. If anyone wants to contact me, uh, please be free. Be, I will really like to talk with anyone who have ideas like feed. Okay, thank you very much.